meteorologist Rick Mitchell with more from our ABC station, NBC station, NBC5 in Dallas, Fort Worth. Almost switched over the weather so bad. Tell us about it, Rick. We have a soon-to-be tropical storm brewing in the Gulf of Mexico. It's not there yet. All right, the plane flew in there today, found the conditions that are favorable for development. Probably by this time tomorrow, we will have tropical storm uh, Claudette. Right now, the center is kind of out in the open. The main convection, the main thunderstorm area is to the east of it. But that is going to organize as we go through tonight on into tomorrow. By 1 o'clock tomorrow, it will likely be tropical storm Claudette on a northward tracks moving to the north at 9 miles per hour right now. By Saturday afternoon, it'll be over an area very close to far western sections of Mississippi. Now, this probably won't end up being a huge wind producer, but it will produce a lot of rain. Already tropical storm warnings in effect from the central Louisiana coast eastward through Alabama. This does include the New Orleans area. Uh, storm surge about two to three feet, so it's not horrendous, but some areas that are typically dry will probably experience some flooding. The rainfall from this system uh, is going to be very heavy. Uh, you see this red swath. That represents about four to eight inches of rain. And it goes through Tuesday, but the majority of that is going to fall uh, from Friday on into uh, Sunday morning. In addition to that, we have some severe weather in the upper Midwest. This is an enhanced area for severe weather from near Minneapolis down to Chicago. Hail, wind, maybe a tornado or two. And then the western U.S. is broiling. Palm Springs tied their all-time record high temperature today to 123 advisories all over the place. And it's pretty hot even back into the Central Plains, but Las Vegas 111, Phoenix 117 right now. Some good news, though, the jet stream pattern that has been baking the West, that's going to break down as we go through the weekend. So hopefully they will see some relief. Shepard. Mitchell, thank you. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.